start in Portugal and Ercera. It's always had good surf. It's very Bells Beach kind of esque. We didn't get to see the wave in its full potential, but you know you can't order surf when you travel. It, it doesn't really work like that. We kind of, for for what was here and for the surfing that went on, we're, we're more than happy. We got men's and women's division. In the beginning, we just had men's, which was cool. We'd invite a girl, but that was like a bunch of dudes and a girl. Now it's a mixed batch. It makes everything a lot better. And the girls add an elegance that the guys don't have with their surfing and style. And you got to see that in a couple of the heats. Champion Chloe Como. And winning your 2019 Duck Tape Portugal, our youngest competitor, 17 years old. He can't even legally drink a beer yet, this kid. Connie L.A. Stewart, break the law, dude. Take a sip. Ow! Shaping's fun, man. You can see it right away with certain people they'll shape and you can spot that they have talent and you can spot other ones that have the idea of design but can't quite make it equate with the planer to foam. But I think the more that people practice it and, and it, it, it helps everything. You know what I mean? Mass produced stuff is cool, but when it's made custom or whatever your brain is that you're thinking and it comes out on a blank makes it even more special. Words I made for this event were a uh, 5.5 swallowtail fish twin fin, and I made a 5.10 swallowtail step deck thruster with lots of concave on the bottom. Performance like old school retro. Um, I did two boards for this contest. One is 7.8, and the other one is a 5.8. Really don't know the sizes. I just went like pretty thick so everyone can use them. So I made two boards. One was a 6.6, like a kind of 90s semi-gun thruster. Really narrow. I actually can't even really remember the dimensions, but it's a really narrow, knifey, thin rails with a swallowtail. And I made a 6.2 diamond tail single fin, inspired by the kind of 80s. And it's pretty thick and pulled back in the tail, but yeah, they look like fun boards. The first one's an eight foot kind of double end board is based on the 1980s and then the second board was off a 1970s cream tunny board which is like my favorite board. The board is nice. I liked it from the beginning the first day I saw it from the look so I had to try it. Really well, yeah. it was quite fun. Like small waves, a bit difficult to, to take them but it was good, really fun. Oh I sat with um Big fish, Ainara. I think it's maybe seven six, something like that. Super bold. I want to buy one. <laughs> uh, we're about to go check a wave around the corner called Crazy Left. It's kind of like a left uh, rip bowl with a wind going into it. It's pretty good for airs and that sort of stuff. Um, there's so many nooks and crannies around this coastline. There's just kind of waves everywhere. And yeah, we got a good crew. It's going to be a good day. <laughs> 